See, I like when you come around. Make you call and be my queen. Oh. Make you move that thing, bring it down. Make you move that thing, bring it down. See, I like when you come around. Make you call and be my queen. Oh. Make you move that thing, bring it down. Make you move that thing, bring it down. Oh. Hey, mommy. You bring it down The way you move the body, girl You shut it down Where you from, girl? Cause I see you around So I'm a boss, man So you know it goes down What's up, you guys? Welcome back to my channel Now, today's video is going to be a get ready with me I'll be showing you guys how to achieve this flawless face As well as these curls But before we get started I'm just going to give you guys some quick details on the hair that I'm wearing The hair that I'm wearing is from an AliExpress vendor This hair is from VIP Beauty here this is their Peruvian straight and wearing four bundles and a lace frontal. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. All the details will be listed down below in the description bar. This is the MAC Studio Finish Concealer. I'm going to take that. I'm going to apply this all over my eyelid as my eyeshadow base. Now to set that eyeshadow, I'm going to use some of the CoverGirl Loose Powder. We're just gonna basically rub this in all the air. So to start, I'm gonna take burnt orange and I'm gonna use that as my transition shade. Take it down for me, take it down for me. The way you move your sexy body, take it down for me. The way you rock in the show, take it down for me. Take it down for me, take it down for me. This brown shade right here, and we're just gonna apply that right in between my creases. And you're gonna take that brush and you're just gonna smoke everything up. So I'm gonna take this deep orange shade right here and apply that right over that brown eyeshadow. I'm gonna take this clean blending brush, it's sort of cool, and just blend everything together. I'm pretty much just blending everything together. I think her eyes should look something like this. I'm the MAC concealer, and I'm just gonna carve out where I want my cut crease to be. This is the eyeshadow palette that I'll be using. This is actually a dupe, I believe, of the Morphe palette. I purchased this on AliExpress. If you guys want, I can leave the link down below in the description bar. For eight bucks for these two eyeshadow palettes, one's a matte palette and one's the shimmer color, which I'll be using right now. But you guys, they're, they're so pigmented. Like you will not believe I purchased this one on AliExpress. Literally, Morphe palette. It looks exactly like it, but it gets the job done. Old shimmery shadow right here. Then I'm gonna take this bronze orangey shade right here and I'm gonna place that directly towards the end. I'm ready, I'm ready now Take my hands and come with 
Oh, well, now we're taking the shimmer shade, this shimmer color right here, and I'm just gonna apply that directly to my brow bone. So I'll be using my Anastasia Beverly Hills on foundation stick shade that I normally use to contour my face and apply that along my jawline. Time. I find doing my foundation this way saves me a lot of time on um contouring and what's not. So I like this method a lot. Apply this to my entire face. I'm gonna go ahead with my foundation brush and the first thing that I'm gonna do is I'm gonna damp it with the Fix Plus. And I'm gonna go in with my NARS concealer and this one is in Caramel. Now to set my entire face, I'll be using the Maybelline Fit Me Matte Poreless Foundation Powder. And I am in the shade Toffee. This is number 330. 330. That's to the areas where I did not apply that um, loose powder. No creases or none of that. One of the darker shades I can't really hold it up because then everything will drop on the floor and and I'm just gonna apply that right here to make those cheeks look nice and plump And then you put a bit down there. I mean, that's really optional. You don't have to, but I do sometimes. And that's pretty much it for that. Okay, now time to highlight. And today I'll be using the MAC. They are new highlighters. This one is an old, old darling. First, I actually learned this technique from Michelle um, Rosh Posh. I think it's her. I don't know. I don't remember her um, YouTube name. But it's Rosh Posh, I think. Or Posh, I don't know. But it's Rochelle. Um, she's from Toronto, so she's so beautiful. But anyways, I learned this. You spray your face before you apply the highlighter. And before it actually dries, I'm going to go in with the highlighter. You cannot tell me you do not see that.
Now we're gonna move back to eyes and I'll be taking that same orange shade right here. I'm just gonna be applying this to my waterline. Why not direct? I'm just gonna be applying this under my waterline. The brown shadow, which is this one right here. This or I'm just gonna apply that directly under that. We're kind of doing like a smoky eye under here. White eyeliner, and I'm gonna apply this into my waterline. Finish off the look, we're just going to add some mascara to your lashes. See, I like when you come around, make you call on me, my queen. Make you move that thing, bring it down. Make you move that thing, bring it down. See, I like when you come around, make you call on me, my queen. Make you move that thing, bring it down. Make you move that thing, bring it down. Okay. I we have my wig cap on. I'm just gonna pull it down, pull it back a little. Take the got to be holding gel, apply that all around my hairline. Take your wig, and you're gonna take your wig and you're just gonna pull it down. I'm gonna pull it down and right where I applied that gel. I'm gonna use a blow dryer. I'm actually just gonna tie my head for about 10 minutes. I'm just gonna tie this for about 10 minutes until it's dried that I'm using is the LA Colors. These are their matte lipstick. I'm gonna go over it with this bright um, orange. You can go ahead and remove the head tie. And the wig is now laid. I'm just gonna finger comb these curls. This hair is so soft. Now to complete the look, I'll be adding the L'Oreal Infallible Pearl Eyeshadow. And I'm just gonna apply that into my inner tear ducts just to highlight it a bit more. I prefer this so much better. Make you move that thing, bring it down. Make you move that 
Bring it down, oh. 